Hey guys, Austin here, and welcome to another mod show. And today we will be taking a look at the Ambraguia mod. And what this mod does is it adds in a ton more weapons, armor, items, and mobs into your world of Minecraft. And before I go any further, I just want to say I have the sign here saying biome. And what it means is there's a biome that goes with this mod where all the stuff can spawn in that. And I honestly looked all over and I could not find the biome anywhere. So, um, you might have better luck with that, but I could not find the biome, so sorry about that. But anyway, um, before I, before I actually start this mod showcase, please leave a like, and if you haven't already done so, subscribe to my channel for more stuff like this, because I always do stuff like this. Anyway, so let's get this started with the tools, weapons, and armor. So, first off, as you can see, there's two sets of basically everything, all the way to the hose. And, um, the first set is the Ambergua set and I don't exactly know how to pronounce that but um yeah basically um the recipe for it is this am I'm just gonna say amber amber material and you make that amber material from these amber fragments and amber fruit and you get that from the blocks etc so let's just put this on right now and see how good it is so as you can see it's about a little probably weaker than iron I'd say but at least I look orange and um Let's try on the other set, the Opron set, and to make that it's Opron ingots, and use that with Opron and iron ingots, and yeah. So let's put this on, and as you can see, it's also it's actually as strong as iron, so now I'm blue. And um, let's just grab both weapons, and we can test that out later. And both weapons have the exact same thing, and the recipes for all these are... Our oops, didn't mean close that chest. Are basically the same as normal Minecraft, just you'd replace it with those items. Okay, so next off we have we'll go over to the blocks and ore section. As you can see, here's the Opron ore you get that from mining, and the and the amber blocks you get from digging up in the amber dimension or not dimension. Why am I saying dimension? Um, the biome, and also there's all this other stuff like the dirt that we're standing on. This will spawn in that dimension. Um, like cobblestone that be there there's also some furnaces and let me just place this down so we can get a good look at it as you can see here's the furnace right click it. I'm I'm assuming it works the same here wait let me just grab something real quick to cook I want to see if it works the same and if it doesn't then oh it doesn't take this as yeah no, it, it must work differently wait I don't know I don't know how this works um wait I have this wonder if Oh, there we go. We put in this um, Amber Disruptor stuff. Wait, you make this? No, I'm assuming you'd find it in that world. And actually, look at the cool designs. It's smelting stuff. So, it's a new furnace that actually takes new fuel and such. So, um, that's pretty cool. If we go back over here, yeah, um, here's just the, the block for that. Let's put all this stuff away. Over here, we have the items. Here's all kinds of different items. There's also... Um, Two different plants. There's amber seeds and Akazaki seeds, and you can use that to make like the fruit in that that you saw before. Um, there's also amber juice. There's hardened leather, which you make with two leather and ironing it, and use that to actually make the seeds. So if you take an amber seed, put it with two regular seeds and arm leather, you that hardened leather, you can get this Akazaki seed or however you pronounce it. Um, here's the just what the open Ron looks like here's um Oberon paste which you can use to make this G1 serum which can be used to make this modif genetically modified amber with the amber fruit um and that's basically it for the items over here we have mobs we have three different kinds of mobs and I have no idea if they're hostile I haven't tested this so we'll actually see what happens that's why I have weapons with me so first we have the thing that attacks me it's an amber lizard it has 10 health and if I kill it it drops bones is that it Come on, attack me. Yep, it just seems to drop bones, and they're they're very mean. I don't know why they hate me. Um, next we have the Amberdillo, which ran to the water immediately. Man, they run fast. I saw them earlier. They just spa they spawned here. Actually, I killed one. But um, as you can see, they make the sound of cows, and they drop that that amber fragment. Let me see if I can kill some more and get more stuff. No, it just seems they actually they drop bones too. Everything seems to drop bones. Wait, come back. I want to kill you one more. One more. 
Yeah, it just seems they drop bones in that fragments, which you can use the fragments, like I said before, to make like the seeds and the material to make armor and that. And lastly, we have the Ambergua Protector. Oh. Oh, I see you're actually really strong. Um, And he drops the fragments of bones also. Here, wait. That actually did me a lot of damage. Let me spawn in another one, see if I can fight him with the other sword. So yeah, I'm assuming this all spawns in that dimension too. I mean, I saw these things spawn here, but I'm assuming they all spawn in like the dimensions. So, um, so yeah, you'll have. I guess this thing could be consider considered a boss, like a very like a mini boss or something. I mean, look at its size and everything. It's made out of the blocks and everything, and it hits like a truck. But um, yeah, guys, it basically wraps up this mod video mod that adds in new biome. I think I said dimension again, and a new biome, not dimension biome, adds in all new items and everything that basically make your Minecraft world a whole lot more fun, and yeah. Oh, also recommend installing non items for this because you will go crazy trying to memorize all these recipes and whatnot, and the download for this mod will be in the description as always, and like I said before, leave a like and subscribe and whatnot, and I will see you guys next time.